Alrighty guys, it's Thursday and I found this one which looks like a challenge. Good gracious, what am I thinking? But we're going to try it. It looks like we do, okay, it says here that the distance between here and here determines the size of your ribbon. So we want to put on a diagonal, we want to put squares alternating with circles and however close we get here makes our ribbon those. it's definitely gonna have to be started in pencil absolutely it's gonna have to be started in pencil um, around the squares we put a little arm and then we do the arm going this way like an aura from that arm And then it looks like that arm from that we aura this one here is going to come up and connect to that circle, right? And then this one is going to come up and around and connect to there. Why do I hear a kitten? Oh my goodness, I hear a baby kitten outside my window. Okay, hang on a second, folks. Let me peek out the window. Hello, little kitty. Nothing? I see no kitten. All right, well, after I'm done here, I will go... I will go check under my deck and see if there is a mama kitty has uh, given birth behind our studio. That is possible. I will check in a minute. Okay, so we've got them going like this and then this comes and connects like this. This is going to be a challenge. i definitely going to draw it in pencil first and then I will ink because this looks like fun, but it also looks like a big challenge. So let's, let's do it. I've got myself a piece of paper. Let's turn on my light so I can see. Uh, I chose a bigger piece of paper just so I have some room to draw. I do like the fact that they made a like a border in a border. Very cool. Um, let me do this one. Distance between this and this is my ribbon size. I should have. Oh, I did a pretty good job making sure I'm kind of on that line. supposed to be kind of straight. Let me look. Yeah, it should be. The square should be on that. Okay, let's try again. Let's try again. I'm 
do it like that. circle goes in between there. We're going to try it like that and see what happens. So these ones each get an arm coming out. And then this gets an arm going this way. So these all get an arm going this way. This way, this way, this way, and this way. This way, this way, this way, and that way. Oop, that one's going the wrong way. See, that's why I'm doing it in pencil. Like a windmill. Like a windmill, Dawn. And then this one's going to come up and around like that. down and around. Okay, so this one goes up and around. No, wrong. Wrong part of the arm. That's why it doesn't match, Dawn. This has to go up and around like this. This one comes up and around like this up and around like this. This one is going to come down and around like that. 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 Okay, so we have an up and around and a down and around. Then this one goes here. Right? Yes. This one comes down and over and it lines up with that. And this one goes that way. This one comes down and around and lines up with that. And that goes like that, like a J. And then this one will go this way. And this lines up with this one. This will go this way and this lines up with that one. This will go this way and this one lines up with this one. And that will come like so. Now, next line. This comes up and connects to this one. Like that. So then 
this one comes up, it connects to that one, like that. And this Up it connects to this one? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So then this one will come up and connect to this one. Right? Am I close? I think I'm close. Can you guys see what I'm doing? Go in a little bit. I'm going to turn it around. So my brain is still going the same direction as it was before. So this one comes up and connects to here. And this comes over and connects to there. And this one comes up and connects to here. And this one comes up and connects to there. This has some thought process to it, doesn't it? This one comes and connects to here. And this one comes up and connects to this one. Okay, and once again, this one connects to this one. And this one connects to this one like that. Just like so. Do I want it to continue all the way to my corner? Or do I want to just leave it just like the way she's kind of left it? I think I'll leave it. I think I'll leave it. Okay, inking time. I'm going to actually ink this one kind of bold, I think. I'm going to go a little bit bigger than I normally do. I'm going to go with a four. Start with this line. Okay, then we're going to go here. Follow this line. I'm going to 
follow this line here. This line this way. There's no way I would have drawn this by myself in ink first. No way. So this is a pattern, but I wouldn't call it a tangle path. Yeah, it's a, definitely a pattern. And I love pattern-based drawing. But you absolutely would not call it a zen tangle because it's too much thought process and you have to really plan it out in pencil. There's no, there's really no doing it just in ink unless you get really good at it. Too many opportunities for a mistake. Okay, I love it though. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Love it. Now, I want to go even bolder with my two borders. That went upwards. All right, we're going to get rid of this. Get rid of that. Something doesn't look right with this corner. Something's still not right with that corner. Let's, let's try again. That's better. Okay. Doesn't have to be perfect, but it needs to be not so far off that I can just like go, oh, that's not right. Okay. Let's get a brush pen, she says skeptically. If I can find it, there it is.
Okay, that's good. And now, a lot of erasing to get rid of all of this construction marks. All of these construction marks. We don't need those anymore. And then we'll do some shading, which will bring this puppy to life. And then we might do, do a little coloring again because I'm just in the mood to color. All right. Lots of shading. Everywhere where there's an over and an under, it needs a shade. How many strings is this actually? It's a couple of them. Maybe I'll do that with my shade, with my coloring, so I can see exactly how many, how many strings would this not be if you were to build it in real life to actually tie this sort of knot. If you were to incorporate it into a physical object, I think you need four. Missed one. All right. Oh, of course. Battery's almost dead. Why would my battery be dead? Because oh, I really need new batteries. All right. Let's 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 play with color here. Let's do uh, let's do a reddish color. Of a reddish color. Kind of a muted color. All right. We're going to follow this cord. This one goes this way. New color. New color. Rinse my brush. What do I have wet? Come on. Oh, this palette thing. This was not this was not a bright move today, Don. Come on. You've got <sighs> issues. I've got issues. Okay, we're going to go with green. Because that's what I have mixed from last time. We just do greens and reds? Sure, why not? Yeah, it's four. That's what I thought it was. It is two green strings and two red strings. A 
Well, that's gone kind of orange. I don't want it orange. I want red. It's my Christmas. It's not Christmas yet. Don't even tell me it's Christmas yet, although Christmas stuff. Christmas stuff is already being sold in the stores. Ay ay ay. I got a little a little carried away with my with my thing there. Let me see if I can get pull that out. I think this type of paper won't let me do that. <sighs> Come on. Let me let me let me lift just a little. Just a little. Can I lift just a little? Nope. It's just going to sit there like that. That's okay. That's okay. Ooh, that one's, that's a little, a little bold. Let me lift some of that. Okay, that's better. All right. I have made a mess. I've enjoyed myself. I'm having fun today. I need a new battery. That one's called Kelt. I need some more some more shading. Where'd my pencil go? There it is. I need some more shading. I need like that and then I need Something like that. Yeah. And then I need... Why? I don't know. It's what I want to do. Battery is going dead. I know my battery is going dead, but this is what I want to do. So, guess what? That's what I'm doing. That's better. Okay. That looks cool. That that's 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 what I wanted. I want a little bit right here. And a little bit right here. Okay, am I done now? I think I'm done. All right, you guys have a great day. I will see you guys on the next video, whatever that video happens to be. Go out and do something nice for someone today. Make the world a better place one person at a time. I will see you tomorrow. And um, we'll, we'll figure this thing out together. I got to go charge my battery. All right, see you guys later. Bye-bye.